Welcome to Electron Line. The next couple of identities start with our basic identity we saw in the previous video, that the, co the hyperbolic cosine squared of x minus the hyperbolic sine squared of x equals 1. What we're going to do now is show that these two identities are indeed true as well. To do that, we're going to take this identity and divide every term by the, cos the hyperbolic cosine squared of x. So divide this by the hyperbolic cosine squared and divide this one by the hyperbolic cosine squared and divide this by the hyperbolic cosine squared of x. Now see what we end up with. This, of course, becomes equal to 1 minus the hyperbolic sine divided the hyperbolic cosine is a hyperbolic tangent, so this becomes the hyperbolic tangent squared of x equals and 1 over the hyperbolic cosine, the inverse of the cosine, that would be the secant, so this becomes the hyperbolic secant square of x. Now let's see what we have over here. That's indeed our first identity, so that's how we can simply find that next identity. Now we do it again, but instead of dividing everything by the hyperbolic cosine, we'll divide everything by the hyperbolic sine. So when we do that, of course that's the hyperbolic sine squared, and here again, hyperbolic sine squared, and hyperbolic sine squared of x. When we do that, the cosine divided by the sine is the tangent, so this becomes a hyperbolic tangent, oh, cotangent, I should say, not tangent, cotangent of x squared minus, this of course becomes 1, equals, and the inverse of the hyperbolic sine becomes the cosecant, hyperbolic cosecant, so cosecant hyperbolic square of x, and notice that's our second identity, and so it's actually fairly simplistic to show that those two identities are true, very similar to the ones you see in trigonometry, except because of the minus, there's a slight difference there. So be careful of that. It's better just to derive them than to try to memorize all of them. So I just would say memorize the first one and then simply derive the other ones. It's pretty quick to do. That's how it's done.